uh, the player who was lucky enough to be able to pair with Armada in that double team, coming up real big and real strong in that, uh, in that game. Good game, buddy. Terrific play. Have a seat. So what was going through your head there at the end in, uh, in game five? Of the set? Dude, I didn't even think I'd get into finals. Like, seriously, <laughs> like I've been playing for literally maybe two months tops, yeah, yeah, a month yeah, competitively. Yeah. And yeah, I, I thought like you know I get like you know a few rounds in and then I get knocked out because you know I'm not a sick of carrying yeah. it. So. <laughs> But man, no, no, it's just like that's what we were saying before. You were actually you were in some of some of the games. You were actually leading the stock a lot of those games. I, I have no idea. Right? <laughs> I was just I was, it was it was once I lost, I realized that it wasn't really about you know there was there was a whole thing of Victoria versus Perth, Absolutely. but then like yeah. I didn't want to let Amada down. That was just basically yeah, he, that yeah, was he, it. He, like he yeah, because yeah, he was carrying me. The, the least I could do is like try my best. So. For about six hours, I played against a Mario and a MK. Really, really. Yeah. Yeah. This morning. Oh wow! Wow. Yeah. So you had very little sleep. sleep. Um, I was alright. I got home at a, at a reasonable time, just went to sleep. But yeah, it was about six hours of that, and then like just, I, you know, I'm tech skill wise, I'm not as good as all these guys. I come like ninth in Melbourne. I'm, I'm literally like B tier. Yeah. But nine goes quite deep in uh, in Perth. It was, it was it was basically like. Yeah, I, I needed to. It, I think. I think like from losers onwards, everyone sort of ignored me, as you could see. Like in the even in the finals, like um, I get gimped off stage, and then they just leave me alone. They wouldn't even bother edge guarding. But I think that kind of hurt them in the long run. That's what we were saying. Yeah, yeah. When they ignore you, when you get those down, down airs, who stops that way? I mean, I had a lot of help from the pros in um, in Australia, and basically Armada was like, the guy's a god. He knows exactly what to do, he knows exactly what you're doing. Like, right before game, he would tell me, all right, you were doing this too much, do this this time. Yeah. And mostly it's just play safe, keep your stocks, and look for opportunities. Well, I'm not sure if you know this, but those two are such a good time. They have been being done with WA right here. Yeah, I've heard. I've heard. I think Victoria as a whole is really surprised at um, the skill of Perth because, like, our top nearly our top guys in Melbourne they don't play PM. We don't. That, that was the first PM doubles match I've ever played in my life. We don't play PM doubles in Melbourne. We play nearly doubles. That's it. I play PM singles. Um, I'm much better at PM than I am nearly. Nearly, I'm like complete trash. PM, I get like last week I broke into the top 13. So. It's very lenient, yeah, it's very lenient in terms of tech, so you can do a lot of things and yeah, and it, it, it comes down more importantly is matchups, knowing knowing not only who you're playing but the kind of style that your person plays. Like I know Corpse Creek from um, Perth plays Toon Link like myself. He doesn't play it like me, I play a very campy style, which really helped because that's what Armada want Armada wanted. But Corpse Creek can do so many like really good combos and like I can't even dream of doing those combos yet. I just need to keep, you know, working as hard as I can. Right, right, right. So uh, I think we're going to get Brawl uh, doubles, is it, on the stream now? So congratulations. Well done on your win. Enjoy it. And uh, I'm good luck in anything you're left in. I'm going to go like dying. Yeah, man. Thank you so much, guys.